show you a couple grenades I found. Yeah, while messing around for a long time. You can't tell because I just uh, switched teams. Alright, so let's say I'm a terrorist who wants to rush long. Should I throw a flashbang here? I mean, if you want to. Don't do that, actually. <laughs> don't do that. You can throw it like this, but it's going to take time for you to run here, right? Yeah. It's great. I've used that flashbang before and took along with it before, but I like doing this. So, once I get in here, I aim at this ring at the door, do a running throw, peek, and then do that. I just found out you can actually peek. I usually don't, and that was the death of me most of the time, but here, do this. Look, the flashbang lands right around here where you really can't see it, but a counter terrorist who's taking that position can. That was a bad example, but okay, here. See? You'll temporarily blind them to the point where you can kill them. Um, so more terrorist smokes. Let's say it's uh, we're doing a split, an A split, right? Terrace, line up right here. Crosshair at this point right here. Jumping throw. And if we did it correctly, see, counter terrorists can barely see through there and really can't spot anybody that's actually there. But terrorists in this corner can see. So it's a pretty useful smoke if it's a split. Get any cheeky picks with that. Right? So that's there. And now let's say terrorists have taken along with those strategies or something else. And counter terrorists want to stop them from peeking pit and just opping them to death. Take a smoke here. Line it up with the right there, the blue thing, the blue sign in that drape. Jumping throw. Or you can just do a regular throw. Either one works. Jumping throw. It's closer to them. I like that. Regular throw is over here. Regular throw is good if uh, someone's car wants to escape. And not be seen. Now, it doesn't cover up this part of it. I'm still trying to figure out what to do there. But let's say a terrorist came along, or a cat, and took sight. I'm that terrorist. And, uh... I want to smoke off CT for my long brethren to come through. Get in the middle of this box, line it up with this right here in the middle, just line it up. Regular throw or jumping throw. That's the regular throw, that's the long, uh, jumping throw. So you, you might want to do the regular throw, but uh, uh. It just depends because I'm on a 64 tick server because I don't play ESEA or face it or anything with the 128 tick. So sorry if you are looking for those, but this is for just normal matchmaking. Now, let's say you have two smokes, right? And you want to cover up back of sight or you want to come out and not be exposed to this many angles that included. So you want to first take probably anybody at car out then at that box window back of sight then door or something like that take a smoke let's say I'm rushing in throw a smoke over there you're probably gonna die but who knows smoke off door or window if you have an extra smoke see oh well see that doesn't work as well that was okay usually it just First time I did it, or second, you know. Ah, uh, but let's say you don't, you have two smokes and are willing to use both of them. Teammate has the second smoke. Line up here, running throw. Should smoke off right there perfectly. And then stand back here, line up, do a running throw. That should smoke off back of sight. And you're good to go, unless he pushes, but. It's pretty much all I have. But, you know, if you really want to mess up the counter-terrorists, wait like 
four or five seconds, that's uh, minimum time for the person closest to mid to come through. And throw a flashbang. It will really mess them up, man. They're going to be confused. But yeah, that's pretty much all I have. Couple of new things here. Okay, for one, let's say you're trying to rotate to A and you hear some footsteps cat, or someone hears footsteps cat, or the mid player spots some cat. Molotov, yes, I found this on Reddit. I didn't make this up myself. This is overpower. Aim right here, right there, right? Then <laughs> these coming cat will get damaged. I'm not getting damaged right now, but. That's because I have God Mode on. So if you do this, pretty much, if you do it right, yeah, it should kill at least one player who's just super confused. Um, now, same thing happens here, but let's say you don't have a molly and you only have a smoke. Go to the barrel here, and right here at this black spot, jumping throw. If you do it right, that wasn't right. Let's try that again. Probably the apex. Yeah, it's the apex of the jump. It should land right there. Restricting access to cat. Or at least discouraging them to come cat. And then you can rotate here. You have enough time. Wait for them to come. Now, we got a couple tea smokes. Now... Let's say we want to do an eight, another A split, right? This is a mid smoke, not Xbox smoke, but mid. Um, yeah, perfect. A quick B smoke. Let's say Terrace have come. Cleared out B. Yep, yeah, they cleared out B, right? I'm a terrorist and I have a smoke because I didn't use it smoking there. Stand right here, aim at that lamp pulse. I did it! Okay, let's revise that. Aim at the edge of the lamp post, do a jumping throw. Yeah, and it should just land perfectly. That wasn't perfect, but apparently it's still okay. So it's exposed from here, so Terra uh, CTs can come through here. But hey, it's it's at least a little bit useful, okay? More smokes this time in mid. Let's say a terrorist comes in through here, right? So from B down to here, and he wants the rest of his team to go cat, but nobody knows any smokes mid. He just aims to smoke here. Let's go. Should be a nice smoke mid. Now, obviously, they're still going to watch Cat. Just as a little bit more of an obstacle. And, you know, Terrace can just push through here. Murder him. Another smoke. This time mid again, but for the counter Terrace. If counter Terrace successfully crosses, tell his team to wait. Right? Aim right here uh, at the bottom left corner of the A. Do a jumping throw. And. It will smoke off cross. But they can still watch cat. Any counter terrorists can still watch cat. So. Terrorists can't watch cross no matter what. Unless you know like. Eh. <laughs> yeah they can't watch cat. Uh, bo boost or cross. Yeah. That's all I've got. <laughs> Let's say I'm a counter terrorist who wants to go cat. Or car, I should say. I am a car, and I hear some long. And they just killed my teammate. I want to get back on site, or at least to elevator. What do I do? Throw the smoke right there. That blocks off that part. Throw the smoke roughly here. That blocks off that part. I'd recommend this because that you could just be exposed to pit there. And you can't carry two smokes on you. So. Throw it right there. 
and you can escape car except for any terrorists over there so just like flash it I guess yeah doubt this does anything <laughs> perfect perfect smoke guys perfect smoke don't use that smoke perfect if they're terrorists over there you can see the smoke already so if terrorists are over here are pretty much blocked and they have to move over here which can be blocked off by the smokes I showed earlier but if they're right here and they let's say wanna take long or they planted long might as well just smoke it off but let's just say they're here trying to take a long right get over here climb on top of this line yourself up right about here smoke grenade aim there jumping throw and that should smoke them off right there yep so now can't see through here and they have to peek over here so you'd know where they are it's pretty easy and yeah let's continue on this smoke is perfect if you're the only one on a site you know there's some mid, and you're trapped in the elevator. You know there's some long, maybe cat. This smoke is perfect. So just go into the corner of the elevator, aim your crosshair at the tip of that box, then just wiggle your throw. It'll land in CT. There'll still be some over here, but honestly, yeah. You get the advantage when they peek out of the smoke because you'll see them before they see you. You can go to pick off long cat. It's perfect smoke, but only for that situation. Honestly, if your team wants to rotate through CT, you know they're none mid or don't think they're any mid, don't use that smoke because your team has to cross it and it's going to be a pain. Say I'm a terrorist. I've taken B site. But I know there's one window and possibly one door. Now all we need to know is that there's one window. Now going over here and smoking window off will be kind of a death sentence. As you can see you're exposed from here, from there, and you can't see it but about here if you get too close. So you don't want to do that, right? Smoking off window this is not that useful of smoke unless in a very, very uh, specific situation. Smoke here. Stand in the corner of this place, I guess. Aim at this box, the corner of this box. Jumping throw. And if done right, it should land directly in the middle of window. It didn't do it here, but it still works no matter what. So they have to peek door. Otherwise, they'll get mauled down. Right? Let's say you want to retake, or you've already cleared out CT and thrown a smoke there, or your teammate has thrown a smoke there. Retake, or, you know, whatever. B. But, you know, because someone came up tunnels, there's someone back of sight, possibly watching you right now. What do you do? Well, you take a smoke... Stand in the corner of this box right here. Roughly in the corner. Stand about right here. Aim there. Jumping throw. That was a fail. Jumping throw. And this one should work. Smoke off back of sight. Now you can push up. And if he pushes, just spray him down.